What's up, what's up? Today is chest day. We're gonna talk about how to build the chest and how to build strength and size by using medium weights. So the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna warm up. You warm up with just a, the bar and maybe with no weight or very light weights. So a lot of that was really to warm up the shoulder muscles, the muscles of the chest. All right, let's add some weight. All right, I'm gonna rest 75 seconds. 75 seconds rest between sets, and then we're just gonna keep increasing. This one I may go about 12 reps. We'll see how it feels. Well, a little bit of a bang on the bar there, a little loss of concentration. As I say, you, you tend to travel within the right, along the track, but every once in a while you tend to move or shift a little bit. That's why it's important to warm up in different directions. I'm gonna keep that weight there today, just so I can talk with you and just keep my focus a little bit. This one I'm gonna go for 12 again. Uh, a little bit more challenging because I'm a little bit fatigued was going to require a little bit more focus. Yes. All right. That was good. That was good. Good 12. Really good push. This is going to be my last set of bench press, and I'm going to go to incline bench press. This one, I'm going for 10. Make your eyes burn. That was intensity. And that's what I'm talking about. Pushing down to the last drop. I mean, it doesn't help to maybe put the bar on the rack when you had two or three more reps you could have done. Work that muscle until you're done. All right, that's four sets on the bench press. We're gonna go on to incline press. All right, I just finished the bench press. Now I'm gonna go to the incline press. I'm on my vector unit now, still incline press machine, all right? All right, that's 12 reps. I'm gonna go up a little bit because I feel like I could have done maybe about four more. So I'm gonna increase the weight and stay with this uh, same movement, but I want to make sure it's a little bit more difficult for me. Increase the weight, one for 12. Okay. Uh, uh, 
little too much. A little bit too much. Albert, you can get eight out of that. I jumped a little bit too much, but that's okay. It still counts though. I'm gonna bring it down to 10 reps now. Usually with your workouts, you're gonna start off with maybe the most repetitions on your first set. And I kinda of keep the weight about the same. As you see, I adjust the weight up and down a little bit to make sure that I get my rep range in. But my rep range right now, the way I'm working out, will be 12 reps on my first set, maybe 12 reps. I'm really pushing to get it on my second set. Uh, my first set of 12, I may be able to get maybe one more, but 12 is usually my goal. And if I can get that goal, then I try to hit it twice. If I can do it twice, then I'll increase the weight the next time. And then my next set, which is my third set, I'll go down to 10 repetitions. And then my last set, which is the fourth, I'll push for eight to 10. All right. Here we go. Yeah. Yes. That's what it should look like. It shouldn't be an easy thing. I mean, the intensity is really what you gotta look at. I'm contracting those muscles as hard as I can, making a real intense effort. I'm gonna go for broke. I'm gonna increase a little bit to the weight that I had difficulty with a moment ago and push for those eight repetitions again. I think I'm psyched up because you're here. I was gonna go for the eighth one, but I didn't have it in me. All right, seven. Still, that's good. Good, all right? We're gonna go to the final exercise, which is pec deck. All right, the last exercise is what we either call the butterfly or the pec deck, uh, but it's gonna be a simple exercise where we're just contracting, pulling it forward. That's first set. As you see, um, the, the idea is to try and hold that contraction. It's really difficult to hold it together in the, in the middle because you're still in the contraction there. So we're gonna do four sets with that exercise, with this weight. 75 seconds rest, set number two. This is going to be the arms out position. You're gonna bring it straight forward. <sighs> Good. I'm trying to pause real briefly at that closed position because I want that contraction. Really the key is contraction. That's set number 10. Two more. Set five seconds up. Number three. 10 reps. not so much to just slam the weight together because you'll notice a lot of guys in the gym they'll just push the weight together and, and, and have it climb but the idea is to really bring it together and pause that's the difficulty and when they bang it together they're really just creating momentum and slamming it so they're really catching it about here so the idea is to hold your contraction in the closed position not bang it and then catch it at, at uh, sort of an open position there because you're not really fully contracting the muscle so when you're pushing, you want to kind of go close as much as you can and then come back, not bang it.
and then bang it again. All right, last set, eight repetitions, and we're done. Ready? Let's do this. Finish strong. Eight reps. sets, chest workout, adjust your weights however you need to. It's been a great workout. I hope you've enjoyed it. I'll see you next time. Remember, you can do this. Bye.